The Youth World Cup Life Painting Competition is currently the largest and most influential youth life painting competition in the world, with competitors coming from different nationalities. As part of UNICEF's global projects, the Youth World Cup Life Painting Competition has attracted participants from 44 nations in the past two years and has raised enough funds for 98 school in a box which in turn has benefited more than 4,000 underprivileged school children worldwide. As a result, the Youth World Cup Life Painting Competition not only has gained international media coverage, but also support from many experts in the field. On a governmental level, it has also garnered support from the First Nations of Canada, the Governor General of Canada, and the Prime Minister of Canada along with the United States, British, and Mexican government. Events like this, the first World Cup, you know, painting competition, it's a great way for us to support UNICEF. Uh, UNICEF's uh, work around the world is based on the Convention of the Rights of the Child. Uh, one, of the, one of the rights that is um, so dear to our our heart um, and the work that is we do around the world is the right to education. So it's very, very touching to us that the funds that are raised through this phen phenomenal event. The kids that were four and five year old really caught my imagination. They were fantastic. They had the creativity, the color, the vigorous and enthusiasm behind those paintings that were literally fantastic. With increasing success and accolade, the third annual Youth World Cup Life Painting Competition is scheduled for the August of 2015. This year, we're expecting to see over 100,000 participants spanning 50 different nations. Let us hope this year will be even more fruitful than ever as we anticipate your participation and support. The world has a lot of art, 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 art